Hey, hi guys, 3D Woody here. Uh, hey, this is a quick video uh, which has nothing to do with 3D printing, although my 3D printer is printing right now. Um, but uh, um, a couple of people have asked me to just post a video on my saltwater fish tank that's always in the background when I'm uh, when I'm doing these videos. So I thought, well, I'll just do a quick video on that. Maybe some people are interested. I don't know. That's my other hobby. So uh, here we go. Uh, okay, so it takes a little bit blue in this picture. There is a lot of blue light in there. Uh, so that's probably why it's coming up blue, but uh, that's a 50 gallon saltwater tank, doing really well, the corals are all uh, uh, doing well and um, actually uh, growing and expanding onto the rock. Um, so uh, I've got about 55 pounds of uh, live rock in there and a lot of softy corals and enemies and a few fish um, everybody's doing well and uh, I don't know it's I'm usually I've usually had bigger tanks uh, 150 200 gallon and they're usually a little bit easier to work with than the smaller ones but in the garage here uh, which is where I do all my work um, that's kind of about all I could fit in there at the time. So, uh, anyways, there's a quick update. Anybody has any questions, want to ask me anything about that, uh, feel free. Love to talk about my tank as well as 3D printing. Well, we'll throw some 3D printing in there anyways just to make, uh, make a... I'm actually, uh, from Thingiverse, there's a, um, a seahorse in there. Um, I've... Uh, going to make it five, 500 times the size, or five times the size, I guess, uh, 500%. So uh, it's just starting out with the base, and uh, I'm doing it in PTEG green. Ah, that's not true. I'm doing PLA. This doesn't look like PTEG, but anyways, it's, uh, it's PLA, this one. And uh, it's just getting started. I'm still using the standard uh, hot end after I switched out the E3 V6. Uh, E3D V6. Uh, you'll see in my other video I had a, I had a problem. Had nothing to do with that at all. But uh, uh, I haven't switched back yet. Anyways, guys, that's kind of. Hang on, my tank. And uh, happy saltwater fishing and uh, 3D printing. Catch you later. Bye.